our goal for our wedding was to have it be in nature. I'm from Park City, Utah, the mountains, and he's grown up in Minnesota and like in outdoors, and I think that so that was important to us. And we wanted kind of a semi destination. Northern yeah. California is not too too far, but it's out of LA. We didn't want we didn't want people to have the option of just like you know what calling it a night around midnight. We want them to be committed all in. And have it be sort of like a little bit like bit a vacation a, slash wedding getaway. Yeah. yeah. Um, and the the venue, one of my girlfriends, she actually had been to a wedding there previously, and was just like, oh my gosh, this place is for you, like. And so just without even ever visiting it, like we, <laughs> like set a date and put deposit down and everything. But um, when we finally got to see it, it was I was so blown away, yeah. and you know just being kind of outside and just having it be ethereal and romantic yeah. and and with our nearest and dearest we didn't want a huge wedding no but of course when you get down to you know the guest list you, there's a lot more people than you could imagine yeah uh, but we're, we're keeping it around like a hundred a little bit above that what I love about Northern California and this uh, the place that we're having it they have a lot of like farm to table organic fresh delicious food the catering that was that was a no-brainer that was really easy and then the flowers I struggle with because I didn't even know the names of flowers I like flowers I was like what is really a, expensive what is a peony what does that look like what yeah. does a dahlia look like I didn't know I didn't know any of that color scheme is is classic and elegant and simple at the same time and exp I think expensive is the adjective and she was looking for he told yeah. me we didn't need flowers, and you know, but luckily, luckily because it's of the, the venue and where we yeah. are, it's it's so beautiful that we don't have to do a lot to kind of spruce it up. Just some nice like accents. My dress, I, when I put it on, I got goosebumps, and I knew that that was the dress I was gonna marry him in, and it had it had all the elements that I really really wanted, and I just I felt myself, and I tried on some other dresses that were a little too bridal for me, and then I put this on and. So gorgeous. He has not seen it yet. Yeah, and she. But for me, I, I think it's unique and it's different and it's um, it's very me. This is the first time in my life I've ever got a custom designed tux from head to toe. You know, I usually just buy off the rack. Um, I'm pretty easy, laid back in regards to my wardrobe and style in general. But like this was <clears throat> handmade from head to toe, so it was a really cool experience yeah. for me. What's up, guys? I'm Juliana Rancic, and you're watching the Live from the Red Carpet YouTube channel. Subscribe today, then be sure to check out our other Live from the Red Carpet videos right here.